today I'm going to be talking about the, like my top favorite lipsticks for either every day and like going out also. These are going to be like vampy, dark, either dark brown, dark reds. And then for every day it's more like a light red or lip stain type thing. Um, just because uh, that's what I wear most of the time. I don't like nude lips. I think it doesn't look right on me. Yeah, so I'll start with uh, my everyday like lipsticks, lip balms and stuff like that. That uh, One of them is by Burt's Bees. And this one's like super moisturizing and it's in rose. And um, this is like what it looks like. It doesn't smell like roses. I don't know why they call it rose, but I guess it because it has like a rose type stain or something on it. By NYC. And uh, it's like the new Applicious. Um, what is it called? Glossy lip balm. It's not even glossy. I don't know why they call it glossy, but it's kind of cute. It has like a little apple in the middle of it. I don't know if you can see it. And uh, this one is in apple plum pie. And this one has a little more color than that one. So if you're looking for a little more color, then go ahead, you can do this one. And that's what that looks like lipstick for every day this one is by NYC also and it is called sheer red and it's like a light sheer red basically and that's what that looks like and you could always like I like to spread it with my finger to kind of make it look more natural and see you could wear that every day and it's really cheap I think it's like a dollar probably the only expensive lipstick I have I've had other ones but my sister always steals them from me so but this one was my favorite and obviously you could tell I used it all up and I used to wear this every single day it's like amazing I literally tried scooping out color and stuff and uh, this one it looks really dark but it's not even dark. Um, it's more like that sheer red color. It's like that, but 10 times better. I love this lipstick. And it's in Lust. Uh, the name of it is, uh, it's a luster lipstick. So it's not matte or anything. It's like, kind of like the lip glosses. They're very moisture. I mean, the chapsticks, they're, it's really moisturizing, but it still gives you a little bit of color. And uh, this one is, the this is by MAC, and it's called Spice It Up. And I love it. Okay, we're going to go into our dark purple lipsticks. And um, this one's by uh, Wet n Wild, the Fergie line. My sister got this for me because she knows I like my my purple lipsticks. Purple is my favorite color, if you can't tell. And uh, I'm trying to collect all purple lipsticks, but this one is called uh, Fergustin Crest Cabernet or something like that. I don't know how to say that's what it's called and this is what it looks like and it's like um I would say like a plummy red um is by Kate Moss and I know everybody talks about this but um it's in 04 and this is Remo London and this is what it looks like I always mix it with other color I mix that's how I am with my foundations my lipsticks I like to mix different products and stuff like that so this is what this looks like And it's a really, um, this one is Vava Violet, and it is by Revlon, and this is what it looks like. It's basically like the same color to me, but I think <coughs> the other one's more purple. I don't know.
I think this one's more moisturizing. The other one kind of felt like dry on my lips. But this is what that looks like. And it might not be perfect, but I'm trying to give you an example of what it looks like. This lip strip at um, the drugstore. And I thought it'd be cool because I'm like, dude, gray, I could rock some gray lips, right? So this lipstick's in by uh, Kate Moss also, and it's in number 15, Remo London. And it's like a gray shimmery color. Like I thought it looked so cool, right? But like it, there's no color payoff. Like this is what, this is how sheer it is. Like, so what I did with this color is I got my color tattoo, the one that's in a toughest taupe and I put it on my lips but I moisturize it I like put concealer over my lips so there's no color and stuff but I put this over my lips and then I took that lipstick gray one and I put it over so if you're like a goth kid or something and you're looking for like a gray unique lip that you know you could do that and that's what it looks like Halloween or a witch you, you're like ooh, I don't want to wear black lipstick I want to wear gray lipstick and make something unique then you could do that uh, deep vampy reds and I have about four and I think I have more in my drawer but I just the first one is um is a lip crayon called uh in wine and I got this at Sally's so this is pretty cool you can use it as a lip liner or an actual lipstick it's supposed to be it just says lip crayon it's by Beautique and I got it at Sally's Beauty Supply Store. And that's what that looks like. It is Black Cherry. It's by uh, Remel, I mean, Revlon. <laughs> Remel. And this is what it looks like. It's like a deep, kind of burgundy color. I haven't really got to wear this lipstick too much, but I love it. It's really pretty. And that's what it looks like. And I did uh, my first makeup tutorial with this color, and it's called Cherry Bomb. So I'll show you what it looks like. And this is what it looks like. And these are, you should really wear and these are matte, these uh, Wet n Wild lipsticks, but they're kind of drying, so I would wear like a, like a chopstick under it or something. Okay, I have two more lipsticks by NYX, and this is like the round ones, and uh, this I got for, at both of them, three bucks at some like Asian hair store that sell NYX products. <laughs> and um, this one is in Histia. And this one melted in my car. <laughs> so, but I could still kind of try to show you what it looks like. Kind of gross, but okay. And I love these cause these are not matte. But they're really moisturizing. Ah, my lips. They're getting all shredded. This one is, I love the name of this lipstick. That's why it's awesome. This one also by NYX and the round lipstick. And this one is called Medusa. And this is what it looks like. Good, I guess.
And that's what that looks like. The only deep brown one that I have, which, but it's pretty freaking awesome. Like, whenever I wear like a, uh, like brown cheetah print leggings that have like brown and gold and or whatever in them, I like to wear this lipstick. It matches perfectly. And this is um, also by Revlon, and it's called Chocolicious. And it's a deep, dark chocolate color. And this is what it looks like. I think it looks pretty cool. And that's what that looks like. And this one is called Chocolicious. Doesn't taste like chocolate. But you can imagine it does. Okay, and that's all for all my dark, vampy lipsticks. And I hope y'all really keep watching. Because I'm going to keep making videos regardless. So, um, have a nice day.